It's very important that as we reflect on the 15 years of transformation, we look at what uh, defines transformation. I think it's important to indicate that transformation has to be defined and it has to be measured. Without the two, everybody would have his or her own definition. And in our case, we always make reference to what we call the scorecard. So when you talk to us about transformation, we will always make a reference to the scorecard. And the nice thing is that we do acknowledge that with times, we need to change it so that it suits the economic times, it suits the social demands. Uh, so what we have there, we've got two generations of scorecard. The first generation was when we established in 2009 to 2017. Jane will remember that time for sure. And then the second generation was when we reviewed in 2017 to 2018. We are in the process also to check whether that scorecard is still relevant for this time. So it's very important also that when we define the transformation, we also define the types of enterprises that will be measured. In this particular case, there are three. We have what we call the medium and large enterprises. I'm glad that GM, you mentioned them all. So we are in the business of knowing uh, about our mandate. And also the qualifying small enterprises and the QSE and the exempted micro enterprises. So how we define the three is that we look at the threshold and also we look at the measurement framework which we refer as the scorecard. So you'll see in the first generation we had a different uh, threshold compared to the second generation and this was because of the economic shift. Secondary to that is that in the in the framework for measuring triple B, then we had to condense some of the elements from five to from seven to five. Moving on to the reporting trends, it, in, in the Triple B Act, it states clear about the reporting requirement. It says if you are in a sector that has a sector code, you must report to the sector council, and that is us if you are in the forest sector. So these slides begins to show the different uh, patterns with regards to the numbers of entities reporting to us. We can see that there has been some increases between the generations, but what is a bit worrying is the fluctuations. And I think as a sector, we need to reflect sincerely on the reporting uh, fluctuation. But more so to that, we need to start understanding the proportionality to say, the proportionality of the reporting entities, what does it reflect or it represent when it comes to the subsector representation? And then it's important that we also look at the triple B levels to say, you always hear us saying, why well, triple B level two, triple B level one, and so on. And I think that DM today has given us a marching mandate to say we need to move from a level three to a level two and a level one. So with regard to that, we're also sharing the two BE levels across the two generations. And you could see that at one point in time, while we see the improvements, we were at level five in the first generation, and we stabilized to a level four uh, with regards to the MLEs. Second to that was that in 2017, 2018, 2018, 2019, was when we transitioned into the new scorecard uh, without any transitional period. So we just expected everybody to jump without allowing you to adjust. But according to the act, that is what is expected. So you can see the, 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 oh, the colors in yellow, 2017, 2018, where we took a dive from a level four to a level six. And uh, the challenge could have been that we didn't have a transitional period. Uh, we just move into the new scorecard. But more so, if you look to the blue line, you can see that it, it, they, there was then also a change due to the national and international crisis due to COVID-19. But the good thing about that is that as a sector, we remain stable. But unfortunately, we had very few numbers of reporting entities in that line. Then post-COVID time, I think uh, we became stronger and show that uh, we are a sector that is, uh, is resilient and we want to do more. And that's when we achieve the encouraging level two, three. And I am hopeful that we are going to achieve the level two and the level one.